What's going on guys? This is Chris back with another video. In today's video, we got our buddy Vince out here doing a little bit of fishing. He doesn't get out and fish too often, <laughs> do you Vince? Got the worker life. <laughs> Not five. The goal is to get him some uh, din din, some snapper for dinner, and of course, you know who we got over here. Chris is dressed like me again, guys. I swear he wakes up, and I, I think he tries to like text me and see what I'm wearing so he can no, be twins. No, get out of there. Hey, so our brand new shirt just just dropped. It should be on the website now. Check it out. Whoa, almost fell off the boat. But of course we had to wear it out here. We got a brand new hoodie, saltyscales.com. Go get you one. You guys didn't see is all the hard work we put in this morning. As you can see, it looks like it is a beautiful day in the Tampa Bay. And it was not that this morning. We had no wind, but there were a huge line of showers that pushed us off the water. We had to go sit at the boat ramp for probably about 30 to 40 minutes. But check this out. We did get us some bait. The perfect baits for catching these snapper as you guys have seen before today i am trying to break in my akuma cavalli you guys have seen this reel in many videos and we really haven't put her to the test guys i'm snipping off this perfect fg knot there you go vince is hooked up on one you got a reel vince oh I didn't think you, I thought you let go. No, you got a reel. Damn. So this is a perfect grouper rig, guys. I might be using it later. Vince got worked <laughs> on the Azores. Man, that Azores got the drag, Vince. You got a reel. I know. The whole goal today is obviously try and uh, free line. But that tide, as you guys can see right there. See that piece of grass? That piece of grass? They are just flowing on by. That tide is ripping it. 25 pound soft steel leader. Oh, they're already on mine. <laughs> Dude, that was, that was a, that was a hit right there. <sighs> I don't know, but that was, he came and slammed it. <laughs> oh, if that don't get you excited. I th oh, my weight hit the bottom, and I was like, all right, weight hit the bottom, and I felt bolt. And I was like, oh, my bait fish is, you know, down there swimming. And bam, slammed it. Dude, that, that was a thump right there. S switch over to the conventional, guys. So um, I had I got to get used to it. Oh, we're going to catch our first keeper fish on the Kavala. Dude, I can't believe that tide's still blitzing like it is right this second. It's going to, what's going to happen is it's going to come to halt. It's going to stop. Yeah. Guys, it's 1.30 right now. We're, we were expecting a high tide at like 2.05. And it was supposed to start slowing down already. As you can see, it's not. It's typical of the tide charts. But once it slows down, then we'll have snapper jumping in the boat. Oh, I just wait. I, I yanked to her. No, he wasn't. He missed it. There he is. Snapper. Damn, head off almost. <laughs> hey man, you gotta be quick with these guys. All right, guys, that is the first like snapper on the Kavala, the open faced conventional rod and reel combo, and that felt good. <laughs> it didn't feel good for him at all. Oh my god, that thing still looking cross eyed. I bass, I bass guy that. What the? That, that fish would be starved for life. <laughs> We let him go. He were, <laughs> he deserved to be let go. Guys, I am getting I'm getting so aggravated right now. My GoPro is literally malfunctioning. Like it's so hot out here. As you can tell, we have no wind right now. So I'm missing all the good action. Josh has met Josh just caught a 17-inch snapper on a pinfish. I lost one or got broken off right away, and he just lost another one. Let's get a line in the water. Hopefully my camera doesn't overheat and catch a freaking fish. Oh, that's a good, that's a good bait. All right, guys, so I don't know how much you've heard, but I lost about a foot of my leader on a big snapper or grouper that bro broke me off on the structure right away. So I retied, got my two watt Gamagatsu. The reason I hooked him, this guy at the top of the head, is because that tide's still ripping so hard. Whenever I drop my weight down, he's going to be able to swim straight ahead, so 
he's not, you know, drowning. Oh, Josh, Josh, look at him. Vince, these are all snapper. See them all? See them all? Oh my God, there's 40 of them. And they're, they're huge. I can't see them. They're, what, you can't see them, Vince? There's 40 of them, bro. I see a little tiny fish floating. I don't see anything underneath them, though. Enjoy our whole operation. Oh, operation snapper. Is in commence, guys. Got a free line with my Kavala here. Yeah, they're all. Oh, oh my God. dude, they're huge, bro. Ones. There's Look some huge them. ones. Just, oh. There you go. Josh is hooked up. Oh. oh, he just took my bait. I had my bail open. Come on, give me. Okay, oh, guys, so I just tossed those baits in. I'm gonna take my bait. Toss it in the middle of them. There he is, guys. Look at him. Look at him. Oh my god. Oh. It's a, okay, okay. I'm having a. Okay. Oh yeah. Stud, stud, stud. Took a shit. Frame over here. Oh wow. Oh, dude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, oh. baby. Oh, dude. All my batteries are dead. Thank you, Vince. You got him? Not really. That's a monster. Oh, Get a head on that sucker. All right, guys, we are rigged up. Got the SRT Inshore Elite. Got it rigged up with my 4000 ITX. Super long leader. This is another five foot leader. Vince just threw out some cub baits. All right, yeah, I think you got to throw more than that, Vince. Oh, he got me. Yeah, he got me too. This will go on there. Yeah, you can't have moves, bro. Okay, I'm gonna take that off after this one. Oh, there you go. oh I got a semi drag. Getting you in that rock right there, you need to tighten that drag. Lock down drag, buddy. Oh, oh yeah, dude. Guys, look at how fat that fish is. Like, that's not the biggest we've caught all the Look at that. Let's go put him on the stick. He is 14 and a half. Fatty. He's not happy to go in there. Just hook in this bait right there, guys, right in the middle. Yeah, you want to just keep feeding just enough line, man, because if they see that, they see your bait fish act Ooh. funny, like he's not drifting. They know that it's not right. There you go. We got a Yeah. for those 22 inches. I keep my fingers, sir. He took my bait. He got me. Again, guys, still rocking that 25 pound soft steel leader to Agamagatsu. Oh, Vince, you're wow. scaring me, bro. Oh, yeah. um, this is 15 pound braid. I decided to switch to the orange braid on the blue rod for uh, football season. It's funny because they analyze it and they wait for uh, one to start. Like they wait for the other one. Oh, Reading frizzly. Yeah. Oh. Little or not, I don't oh. care. It's a fish. It's a fish and he's fat. He's probably 14. All right guys, that is a keeper, but he's going home. A ton of people. Next bait. Oh, you got one, Vince. Real, real. You didn't see your line. I you had one. You I had one it. for like a second and a half. That is a smaller one. Yeah, you were sleeping on that one. Oh, got me. All right, guys. Let's uh, teach Vince how to do braid to a leader. Here. Lay him. Crossover. 
each other like that. Go through that's like over the leader, through the circle, over the leader, through the circle. Three, four times. And I should have made that tag a little bit bigger. It helped me out. Two main lines, bring them together and then let it tighten each other off on top Jeez. of each other. Stay so crude. they're basically like pulling on each other. Yeah. Can you record? There he is, he's trying to get in that rock. That's a good one. That's a good one. Right. That's a workout. Oh man. Why is he bleeding? Oh, Josh is hooked up, guys. I'm his cameraman. His batteries are dead. Real, real, real. Vince, you better get that net. Oh, he's in the. Real, you got him. You got him. You got a real. No. Oh, it's a stud. It's a monster grouper. Oh, that's like a tw <laughs> thirty baby. Give us redemption, baby. baby. Redemption, baby. <laughs> I got a snapper under me. I'm trying to keep. <laughs> Yeah, that's why you weren't catching him. You were using a 3,000 size reel. Yes. Measure him. Oh. <laughs> I just got soaking wet. I'm at Shamu, the Shamu world, the splash zone. Oh, that's it. Oh, my biggest of the day on the Kavala too. Right when I put the rod down, like right when I put the rod down. Got him. On the Kavala, guys. Put it down. Put the clicker on, and right when I go grab my other rod, he gets slammed on a pinfish. And he did swallow it, for sure. Nice. Quarter. Woo. That was on that, the dead pinfish. Another pinfish. Another one. Oh, there you go, Vince. Vince is hooked. Small for the day. <laughs> oh. Hold on. There you go. <laughs> Little grouper. There's Chris's grouper. <laughs> yeah, buddy. We joined the grouper club. <laughs> Our snapper had been guys, bigger. <laughs> that's, that's Chris's grouper. Damn snapper, eat that grouper. Yeah, you're not joking. He'll be a keeper one day. Oh, snapper coming up. If I can get this hook out. There we go. All right, dude. Going home. Uh, all right, guys. What freaking day it's been. Um, we just got done taking some photos for the gram. You know how it goes. Some thumbnails. Check out this uh, this basket. This what our basket ended up looking like. Josh's keeper fatty grouper coming in at what? 28? About 28. 28 inches. And all 15 snapper. We limited it out today. So I don't think we're going to need to put any more meat in the freezer for a little while. Vin Vince is probably going to take a lot of those, that's for sure. We threw a lot of back. Yeah, we did. We did. Yeah. We threw tons of them back, but I can't express, I don't even know what you guys got to see because me and Josh have just had nightmarish issues today. His, primarily from the GoPro cameras, one of his batteries got stuck in his camera. He couldn't get it out. Me, I was trying to get used to that uh, Kavala and, uh, you know, I really wanted to break the ice with the Kavala, which I did. I don't even know if you guys saw it because I was having some camera issues myself, but that's how it goes. Other than that, man, we slayed. Vince had a great day out here on the water. He doesn't get out here nearly enough. We got to change that. Uh, but man, let's go back to the boat ramp, clean some fish.
Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please smash that like button, subscribe for more fishing and outdoor content. Go shop saltyscales.com. Check out this new hoodie we got. It should be on the website. Go get you one, limited edition. They're not gonna last long, trust me. Comment down below. You guys been out in the Tampa Bay in a while? Uh, I know that the red tide situation is on the up and up. It's looking good. The bay's rebounding. It's pretty healthy. I mean, there's fish out there to be caught. Just to let you know, I still am for redfish, trout, and snook to stay closed. I do hope that they stay closed. Uh, but snapper and grouper, man, as you guys can see, they're super healthy. There's plenty out there to be caught, 